The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier, and our first reading is from the book of the prophet Jeremiah. I heard so many disparaging me. Terror on every side. Denounce him. Let us denounce him. All those who were on good terms with me watched for my downfall. Perhaps he will be seduced into error. Then we shall get the better of him and take our revenge. But Yahweh is at my side like a mighty hero. My opponents will stumble, vanquished, confounded by their failure. Everlasting, unforgettable disgrace will be theirs. Yahweh Sabaoth, you who test the upright, observer of motives and thoughts, I shall see your vengeance on them, for I have revealed my cause to you. Sing to Yahweh, praise Yahweh, for he has delivered the soul of one in need from the clutches of evildoers. And our response is from Psalm 18. Yahweh is my rock and my fortress. My deliverer is my God. I take refuge in him, my rock, my shield, my saving strength, my stronghold, my place of refuge. I call to Yahweh who is worthy of praise and I am saved from my foes. With death's breakers closing in on me, Belial's torrents ready to swallow me, Sheol's snares every side of me, death's traps lying ahead of me. I called to Yahweh in my anguish. I cried for help to my God. From his temple he heard my voice. My cry came to his ears. Then the earth quaked and rocked. The mountain's foundations shuddered. They quaked at his blazing anger. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. The Jews fetched stones to stone him. So Jesus said to them, I have shown you many good works from my Father. For which of these are you stoning me? The Jews answered him, We are stoning you not for doing a good work, but for blasphemy. Though you are only a man, you claim to be God. Jesus answered, Is it not written in your law, I said, you are gods? So it uses the word gods of those people to whom the word of God was addressed. And scripture cannot be set aside. Yet to someone whom the Father has consecrated and sent into the world, you say, you are blaspheming. Because I said, I am son of God. If I am not doing my Father's work, there is no need to believe me. But if I am doing it, then even if you refuse to believe in me, at least believe in the work I do. Then you will know for certain that the Father is in me, and I am in the Father. They again wanted to arrest him then, but he eluded their clutches. He went back again to the far side of the Jordan, to the district where John had been baptizing at first, and he stayed there. Many people who came to him said, John gave no signs, but all he said about this man was true. And many of them believed in him. The Gospel of the Lord.